Meteorologist Joe Hansel here with a Wednesday, middle of the week, January 22nd, 2020. Check your national severe weather threats. Uh, central third of the nation, we got a big winter blast of precip. It's kind of a forecast that includes rain, sleet, ice, heavy snow, and chance of thunderstorms. And also areas in the Pacific Northwest. It's like a broken record. Been mentioning it off and on basically for the last couple of weeks. But our next warm front from the Pacific going to bring in areas of heavy rain and mountain snow out in the Inner Mountain West. Uh, areas of ice and snow already accumulating. Upper Midwest, Great Plains, portions of the Mississippi River Valley. Chance of thunderstorms from Dallas south to Houston today. Not expecting severe weather, but there will be that potential for some heavy rain as we have a a lot of Gulf Mexico, uh, Mexico moisture diving into this system. Winter weather advisories today from areas north of Texarkana cutting into southeast Minnesota, where uh, we will be watching for areas of rain to the south, significant in areas of the southeast where it's been a very rainy month of January. And speaking of that, go to Seattle and Portland. One to two inches of rain still possible through Friday evening. Snow levels may actually increase, so rain may actually fall in the mountains by tomorrow increasing concerns about flooding out there. Cities like Houston, Little Rock, Arkansas, over an inch of rain in the forecast, potentially possible and areas of the southeast through Friday as well. For snow, anywhere from a half a foot to over a foot through Friday, again, is possible up and down portions of the Cascades and the Rockies of Montana, Idaho, and western Wyoming. Jackson Hole, Wyoming could see about an inch or two of snow as well. A half a foot or more of thick, wet snow through Friday. This is over three days. Possible from areas near Kansas City to Des Moines, northeast through Wisconsin, Marquette, Chicago, watching for a few inches of snow, too. So rain to the south, snow to the north, Neapolitan kind of pink colors, a mixture of sleet and freezing rain in between. All that works across the Mississippi River Valley, and it's connected from the Gulf to the, Gulf, uh, to the Great Lakes as it continues to work east tonight into the day tomorrow.